in the very first round, the 22-year-old Kiwi threw a big lifetime best of 21-23, a new national record, and confirming he's truly amongst the world's elite and favourite for Commonwealth gold in two weeks' time. Well, while Walsh couldn't improve on that round one effort, double world champion David Stahl of Germany left it to round five to show his best. Fresh from a big win in Paris just six days ago, Stahl had thrown 21-26 in round four. But here, in round five, eased past the New Zealander with 21 metres 38. It was one of only three valid efforts, but it only takes one big throw, as Stahl knows all too well. But the men's shot is going through an astonishing period. No less than 14 athletes have gone beyond 21 metres this year. And in this contest, where world number one's Joe Kovac could place only four, it was Rhys Hoffer who came out on top. His excellent series was topped by his round three effort of 21 metres 67, the best of four efforts beyond 21 metres. One of the shortest of world-class throwers, he is one of the fastest, but this five-time US champion was by far the oldest in the field at 36, and today, by far the best. Hoffa giving some sort of revenge there, or gaining some sort of revenge on Stuhl, who uh, defeated him in Paris six days ago. It's a young man's and an older man's event, the shot, it appears. Confirmation of that win for Hoffa, the American 21 metres 67 with a new season's best ahead of Stahl and Walsh's at New Zealand national record. Kovacs in fourth. And in the diamond race points, uh, it's still nicely poised. Hoffa on 11 with Kovacs on eight. Stahl down in eight, uh, sharing second place as well. <laughs>